What is up guys and welcome back. Today we're going to grab two things here. We're going to grab the Primal Tamer's Baton, which is the unique weapon in Scylla, as well as the Tospel All-Star Trophy. So you might as well do this at the same time. Now, as soon as you get to Scylla, you can head down to the southwest corner. And this is going to be just behind that large digging thing. And over here you're going to find a dead dude. And next to him is going to be the Primal Baton. And this has a specific use towards or effectiveness towards the primals, as you would assume. As you can see here in the description. Space of choice, primal tamers button. Hardly a tamers when you're ripping them apart, but yeah, whatever. And now with the all-star, what you have to do is get a certain number of kills with the button. I think it's 100 kills. Now to help you get there, you can go to the workbench and upgrade your baton as much as you like. This particular baton I'm using here isn't the tamer's choice, it was earlier footage, but I do switch to it um, a little bit later. Now because I wanted to smash this trophy out as quick as possible, I kind of used it all the time at the start to try and get the trophy smashed out. There are a couple of tips you can do, you can also try and sneak up on enemies, you'll get a massive uh, damage increase if you manage to get a critical sneak attack. These guys as well, these small little creatures that are running around, the sprats, the space rats, those also count as enemies, so you can smash those guys out, and they're knocking around the ground breaker as well, so they're pretty much everywhere. It's advised to use your time delay there, because it's very difficult to actually hit them. But other than that, upgrade your baton as much as you can, and go to town on any enemy that you find. So guys, I'm going to let the showcase play out, and I'm going to catch you at the end. So there we go guys, it's a good idea to smash this trophy out early because there are so many better weapons than that particular one. But if you're a completionist like me, you'll want all of these unique weapons in your storage by the end of the game anyways. This weapon I'm playing with now is the Salvage's Helper. That's the different unique weapon, also found on the Groundbreaker, and that video is going to be up within the next hour or so. It absolutely owns, it's got a 600 and something DPS as you start, so very very cool. But guys, please remember, if you're enjoying the content, smash the like button and subscribe if you are really enjoying it. Also remember, if you're having trouble with any games, you can contact me via my email in the description about SharePlay and we can take it from there. So guys, I want to say thanks for watching and I'm going to catch you on the next one.